sit in the car and drive down to a you know Long Beach or something for a uh-huh. show and we were working on those tone those those parts uh-huh. for smile wow. all the way back then. Right you know why? Yeah, sick about that. Yeah. Anyway, uh, we all thought we were pretty cool and <laughs> <laughs> doing it with Carl Carl you'll be the tuner or whatever. Carl was an oboe, I was a clarinet, Mike was a baritone or something and Brian was a soprano. Okay. So he was pretty good soprano too.
I hear an engine. I think I hear a banjo in the back. Of it. Sounds like the California Gold Rush. Yes, it does. This is Jared Daly back there on the banjo.
They said for your things and put you in an ice hotel. Knew I was doing good. They typed it on an empty word. My letter came all the way by U.S. mail. They said they could use a man who could read a set of blueprint plans. By the time you read the sobby flying over me. I 
other day I'm trying to find a place just to get away we Thank you. 
this guitar turned up more. Than... <laughs> so funny. Acoustics are an amazing thing. Okay. Um... Who like to say, are we going to play this little thing? Uh, uh, Billy, I'd like to introduce my musical director, Billy Henchy. Uh, he's an amazing guy. He's all year long and all year long. He's been there for me. And, uh, you know, I'm sure you remember his, his uh, merits and uh, the demerits. <laughs> Should we meet the band? Is it time to meet this band? Did he's going to be the four way move on into other areas. Yeah, I'm Billy Hitchy, I'm Alice's musical director. How many, I wonder, of you remember my old group, Dino, Desi, and Bill? There's a lot of you here. Just getting back to Woodstock, huh? I think this guy walked back, I remember. But anyway, uh, our group opened for the Beach Boys back in uh, July of 65 at the Hollywood Bowl, and they went on to take us on the road with them, and I eventually join the Beach Boys, as a lot of you know, my sister Annie married Carl Wilson, and uh, it's been a family affair ever since. And uh, so, that brings us to the scene now. I want you to meet this fabulous band standing behind me. He's, he's our newest and youngest member. He hails from the great state of Idaho by way of Las Vegas. Say hi to Jared Daly, please. So Dally and the Alley with Sally on drums. He's one of the veterans of the Beach Boys band, and I'm sure you've seen him on a lot of the TV specials from Hawaii. And he's also a fine actor. You might have seen him on Just Shoot Me or The Larry Sanders Show. Say hi to our singing, drumming, acting drummer, Bobby Figueroa. And holding down the duties on the uh, auxiliary keyboards, he comes from a rhythm and blues background, and he's played with some of the greats like Chuck Berry and many, many others. Say hi to the right reverend Tom Jacob. And uh, holding down the duties on bass, he is just uh, rock solid, Carl Wilson's favorite bass player. And I don't know, some of you may not know this, but he was a very good friend of Jimi Hendrix. And this is true. They met in England. Is that right? Now, I can't remember the story. Did you smoke a bowl of cereal or you had a bowl of cereal with Jim? I can't remember. Anyway. Say hi to Smiling Ed Carter, please. <laughs> and of course, doing a great job on stage left, Matthew Jardine, doing a beautiful job. Right, doing a great job tonight, Adam Jardine. Yeah. And we'd like to say hi to all the various members of the Beach Boys band that are here tonight. Uh, I know John Castle is here, and Nelson Brad is here, and uh, Tim Bonham is here. We welcome you. We welcome members of the Wilson family, the Jardine family. They're sitting up there. Thank you for coming down and being so supportive. We've got Dennis's children, we've got Carl and Annie's children. Anyway, everybody's here tonight. You're welcome to be a part of this extended family. We always like to take this moment in the show to dedicate this song to the great Carl Wilson. And um, in fact, I'm going to wear my Carl Wilson Foundation baseball cap for this. We've done shows here, maybe some of you attended uh, them for Carl. Anyway, this is for Carl, and it goes like this. Stars above you. You never need to doubt it. 
farm. You get to just come up here and sing all these great songs. <laughs> Pretty cool.
Uh, Steve Miller, he brought in his, uh, this incredible uh, harp player, uh, Norton Buffalo, who was on the stage with him for 30 years, you know, and anyway. So, uh, Norton is on this, and also Flea. He, uh, our friend Flea, you know, from the Peppers. Okay, he's doing this mean bass line, you won't believe it. Now, I don't know if Eddie's singing, are you playing the Flea line or the Beach Bar line? You're playing the Beach Bar line, probably. Well, you're going to get a little bit of both. We're having the Beast Boy bass in, in, the, uh, in the Norton uh, Harmon. Okay, that's what Okay. Yeah. 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 and to the Beach Boys and everybody. And I know you know him, you love him. He's a really great actor and a really great guy. Please give a big, warm round of applause to John Stamos. Hey! There's so many great uh, musicians and people here. I don't know why I'm, I'm up here. But if I may say it, and I've been a, a super fan my whole life and, and honored enough to, to call myself a friend of Al Jardine and the Beach Boys, I must say, Al, that you sound... Are there cameras rolling? Let me just say, oh, then I've got to read. You sound as good as you've ever sounded, Al. Okay? All the guys sound great. But you, you sound like you're 18 years old. What a, what a thrill to see you. And... Uh, your constant um, uh, search for 
the truth and honesty in this music is inspiring, Al. So thank you very much. And one more time is taking his position at the drums. We'd like to wish a very special happy birthday to our friend Bridget Bilicic, who turns 20 today. Thank you for being here, Bridget. She works for the record company. She's been doing a really great job. All right, we got time for a couple more. Bobby's gonna come up and say we're done. That's okay.